good day to you. My name is Maria Kunczewska and this is Poland Daily Culture and we continue our discussions about jazz and soul and we have an absolute expert in this field, Stan Breckenridge. Again, thank you very much for showing up in our studio. Well, thank you for having me here. Thank you. And you are an American performer right now living here in Poland playing jazz and soul and you have 11 albums in your credit, like which yes. you created and published before. Uh, tell us when you look through it, how your uh, like style of music evolved. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a very good question. You know, I, I think most musicians may feel the same way. When we record an album or a song, right? That's it's it's a particular little key to a particular point in time. And so as I move forward, I think about that song and I'm able to think about where I was, right, mentally, socially, my thoughts about people, about places, about things. My music has evolved. A big part of it is because of my being in different countries. I would say most significantly at this point, I have been in Poland more so than I have in any other country besides the States. And so Poland has enriched, has helped to shape, has helped me has helped m me <laughs> to see myself better because of the interaction in which I have with a number of artists here. And I really want to take this time to thank, you know, the first band in Poland that I came in contact with would be Jazz Man Ball Orchestra. And this is, I believe, Poland's longest running traditional jazz band. They're based in Krakow. And um, it started there. And so through them and through my concerts, through touring, etc., I began to look more at myself and I realized that my music was evolving because of all of the other influences that I was getting from them and others. So it's people, other people who it's, you it's, are it's meaning. People. Absolutely, absolutely. And you took part in a project of Elias yes. songs, yes. where mm -hmm. Polish songs tak, you took tak. part in that. Yes. So of course the question is, what Polish songs are your favorite? Yes, yes. Well, uh, my, my goodness. Um, so on this particular album, I sang four four songs. Um, da 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 da. Right. And um, um, so. Um, one of my favorites, though, although I didn't sing it on this album, is, of course, er everyone knows this song. Po papugami, yes, <laughs> <laughs> roku niklov maniba. <laughs> well, this is... Czesław, tak? Of <laughs> course, yes, yes, yes. Czesław Niemann. Nie, nie, nie. Well, mm -hmm. very nicely performed. <laughs> um, but uh, so this Polish tradition, jazz tradition, is much, of course, smaller and shorter. And uh, not it, jazz was not always so popular here. Uh, but uh, we have, I would say, few performances and few people mm -hmm. doing it. But um, you looking all together at Polish music, is there anything like... Uh, uh, except Niemann, which, <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, which uh, you listen or, okay, you hear Mazurek or you hear something like this, uh, which is totally not jazz. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm, like, uh, like uh, what, what is your experience of it? Is it always uh, gloomy and sad or are they, <laughs> yes. are they some happier parts? <laughs> It is very, very happy, all the way from, well, I am fascinated with Polish folk music, as I am with most, with every culture's folk music, because it's music of the folk, right? And so I'm, I am familiar with this. I am also familiar music from, from right, the Zagopane, right? Highlander music, yes, you know? And so um, th this is, and, and of course, I, I must say it. P people ask me, "Do you like disco polo?" You know. And, <laughs> I wanted to avoid this question, you know, but, but but you know, um, first first of all, I wrote this book titled "Music Taste or Waste," and basically, it's a book about using various techniques to better articulate why you find a music good or wasteful. And so for me, as a uh, scholar, you know, I find value in 
disco polo. Now, it's, 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 it's nothing that I would usually perform, but there is value in it. Why? Because there's value to someone. I know it may be like superficial, just like our disco music was back in the 70s, yes? Uh, but, you know, every culture has its own m music that perhaps they may not want to be associated with, yes? But then, of course, you have Chopin, right? So, you know. <laughs> well, this cupola brings so much pleasure at the weddings. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yes, well, the it does. The only thing is yes. left for us is... Uh, I want to see you once performing this cappella. Okay, okay. <laughs> and we invite you, of course, to watch and listen to proper soul and jazz of Stan Breckenridge, uh, which you, the part of it, you can listen right now. And again, thank you for watching Poland Daily. <laughs> Tell me why? 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 Why?